Today I'm very, very happy to be here. I'm very happy to do this video because we have a really huge news. This is really a huge news today. For the first time here, I have a sentence. I have a sentence of a case won for Italian citizenship by the Senate through the court path because of the lack of appointment to the Italian Council that it was processed under the new law, the new legislation. So it was processed by the local immigration courts. This is Marco Bersani, as always, from the Bersani law freedom and partners from Italy, an Italian immigration law queen with expertise on Italian citizenship application. Do not lose any more time, I will explain you later about in details what happened and let's start. As I said, today is a really, really huge video that we are making because for the first time in Italy, I think this is the first sentence that was published by a judge about the new process of the core path. So let's see in detail what happened. We are talking about the core path. So in case you want to file your application for Italian citizenship by descent, but you are facing the lack of appointment through the consulate, for example, you are your documentation ready, you want to file your application, you go on the Italian consular website because you want to book your appointment and you see there are no appointments. You try every day, you click, click, refresh the page and every time you see a pop-up notification that says there are no appointments available. Or in other cases, for example, you can find a spot. You can, for example, email a consular and the consular will say to you, yeah, the first appointment available is in 2027, is in 2028. One side, you can just wait. You can wait many years. But the law recognizes you to file your application through an Italian immigration court. The legal basis is that by the law, the Italian consulate needs and have to proceed in maximum two years. There is a legal term that is mandatory by the law. So they cannot take more than two years for giving you an appointment and they cannot take more than two years for deciding your application. And so, if you are facing a violation of this legal term or, for example, you are facing the lack of appointments, as it happens right now in all United States, for example, what you can do? Well, you can sign a power of attorney to us, for example, and we can file your petition for you. So what happened in details about this case? We had a client, particularly a family. So we have a family of uh, five people from the United States. Beware that we are talking about this case, but the same legal principle can be applicable to all cases. So also if you live in Los Angeles, in San Francisco, in Detroit, in New York, in Miami, in Boston, the same rule will apply also if you live in other states and also of course also outside the United States also if you live in Canada in Toronto Montreal Vancouver it's the same in Australia is the same so they tried it was like one year they tried to book an appointment through the local Italian consul in Chicago and they were not able to book the appointment and so we file the application. Beware of that the old law that recognized to file the petition through the tribunal in Rome and only in Rome was, as I said, the law 206 of 2022 took place on June 20th of last year. And the day after, on June 21, we filed the case. So we filed the case with a new law, with a new legislation to a new tribunal. I don't know if it, this is the first case in the entire Italy that was filed with a new law. For sure, one of the first cases. The case was processed very fast because you know it's a new way to file. The court are new to the processes and so what the judge says. The judge says that all applicants prove that they have an Italian heritage so we provided all the vita records the same as you have to provide if you want to apply through the local Italian consulate so starting from the Italian SSO to you as applicant, birth certificate, the marriage certificate, that certificate, naturalization records or proof of non naturalization naturalization and so I mean everything that proves that you have an Italian heritage you are the descendant of that Italian ancestor and you have the right to claim your Italian citizenship by descent. The applicants also proved that they tried their best effort to book an appointment 
at the local Italian consulate, but it was really pretty impossible. There is a huge wait time. The huge wait time, says the judge, is the same as deny a case. That's very important. The judge say that if you have to wait many years for your appointment at the consulate, is the same as deny your case. Because, as the judge says, this goes by the law 241 of 1990, the administration, the public administration must process the application for Italian citizenship by descent in maximum two years. And so if the council doesn't respect the term, the legal term, well, it's like the case was denied. And so the applicant had the right to file the application through the court and so the judge can recognize them Italian citizenship by descent. So for the first time we had a legal precedent, a case that was won with the new law, with the new courts. So we can say that right now the court path will continue in time will continue for the next month for the next year so if you are facing lack of appointment through the italian consulate well you can file an application through your italian immigration attorney we can file your application for you and you can ask for the judge for a judge to recognize your italian citizenship by descent of course if you have questions if you have some doubts if you want something you want to ask as always you can contact us through our website there is a contact form you can use for free you can also leave a comment below the team is always happy to reply to, to your questions of course if we cannot do some consultations we cannot do legal consultations online here on YouTube of course thank you so much as always and see you on the next videos